under other one. Uh, this cross section is similar with the previous one, but the sequence of the depreciation of value is quite different. Okay, in the previous video, again again that is included in the strata. If we look at this, either the net is included in the strata or not. We have to find out that. Okay, but is it is also a very interesting one. Okay, from the previous one, this is also uh, not interesting. One, okay. We learn something from this video okay now how we start again we will go with the fault if i look at this fault this fault is not extending over this and uh, this fault is cutting the all formations okay our wedding so obviously this fault uh, this fault is older than this fault at least older than natural now if we look at this part, this green net, okay. Yeah, this is not clear dimensions, but I okay. If we look at this green net, I it is displaced by this. Oh, this fault, okay. And one more thing that this into the not extending above this. Okay, and. Uh, why this is that much interesting? Just look at it. Okay. Yeah, because this part is very, uh, this part is very important, so I will remove. That's why. Okay. It's a very interesting part. Why? I will tell you. Now, uh, A is also. Okay, up to the CG grid. Now, if we look at the unconformities, okay. Here we have an unconformity, okay. And here we also have the unconformity. Okay, here we have the unconformity, okay. And there is one more unconformity here, okay. Numbering is not given, so I put something for that okay so that it is equal as which one is older so like one two and three and uh, okay now if we you know here we also have an uncommunity if we go with numbering okay if we go with the word number either two or three which one will come? Okay, which one will come? Answer is here. Okay, answer is here. Uh, if we closely observe, this granite is not included in this part, and this part is horizontal, and we get this data here. This data here, and this part is sorry not here we're getting this data here this is m this is m over okay and about that we have this dotted layer so that we have this dotted layer and okay so it means there is uh, this, this one is and here we have a one more conformity okay this is the lower conformity. This is number two. This is number two. And this number, its situation is like this, okay? Here we have one more conformity. And here we have unconformity. This is granitic body. And we are getting horizontal strata and dotted strata. This is our unconformity two. And this is over unconformity 3. Okay, the unconformity 3 erodes with unconformity 2. Okay, hope you understand. Okay, now I just remove this because I have to write now this side. Now, 
uh, that you are different it means this one component is number 3 instead of number 2 because 2 is and commodity 2 is eroded by okay that's why I circle this part and it is very important now you got it okay for what reason I have okay now uh, which one is the older one okay if we look at this part okay a a is intruded by 1 as well as unconformity 2 okay so in this in this part uh, this is a kinetic body okay a is a kinetic it acts as a basement for the deposition okay basement for the deposition so and one more reason why I put A as a holder because if we look at above set that are lying above the A, it follow the same setup and the thickness of the bed is also same. Okay, if this granite is intruded into it, it has to be go into it, intruding into it. Okay, eating up process. It is not happening here. Okay, so it means for that reason I put. A as a basement rock. Okay. Basement rock. Now we are able to find the basement rock. After that, there is an erosional process. One that erodes the basin. Basement rock A. After that is again after that uh, you know. Uh, that A is uh, basement is submerged, okay, and we have what a sequence of sediments, okay, B, C, D, B, C, D, J, K, okay, we got B, C, D, J, K why I put all the things in a sequence because as such I'm not getting anything on the basis that we can say this part is deposit later okay and uh, here we have a anticline here we have a syncline okay uh, then after the deposition of B, C, D, J, K folding to place usually folding will also happen with this but folding to place and folding also ok which folding to place this faulting took place. Okay. If we put, if I want to know either this fault block is going down and this block is going up, I'm unable to identify within the same lithology. Okay. We have to find where the contrasting lithology. Okay. We we'll look at this part. This side we have a igneous body. This we have a sedimentary part. Okay. Obviously, this part is going up. Why I put this part going up? Okay, because if I found if I look at this part, I found igneous and above that we have a dotted circuits, but here I'm getting a much younger rock above this granite. Okay, either that part is exposed, this part is going to be exposed now, only then uh, this part is. Okay, so uh, now this is what kind of setup this block is going up and this block is going down. This is a fault, and which fault it is? Uh, L, and it is a reverse fault. Okay, after that, the whole basin is uplift. 
okay and erosion took place erosion of this sedimentary strata as well as this granite some part of granite basement that is exposed again due to adverse fault and the whole basin is you know exposed to the air and uh, uh, weathering started okay and again this granite is weathering okay this is not uh, not why this first erosion it is as a second erosion because all the strata lying above this okay this this part you are saying in this part the same setup is we said also no? but that, due to the upliftment of this part all strata above that is eroded okay and the granite is again eroded okay so then there is an conformity number two what kind of uncommonity it is okay here if we say that against what is detective of the sediment what kind of uncommonity mention in the comment box and if we look at this part we are angular strata and above that we have a, a slight deeper strata so what kind of uncommonity it is just mentioned in the comment box okay so after the two then there is a repetition of this is over 2 ok this side this is over 2 this side this is over 2 ok and it is now it is eroded by our major and uh, one more uncompromity that is 3 ok <coughs> now there is a repetition of after that M and ok ok after that now erosion took place and form an uncomfortability okay that erode this this strata m and no okay and uh, here we are able to find out that it also erode our previous uncomfortability or uh, previous uh, uh, uncomfortability also the lower one uncomfortability also okay so this is our third uncomfortability okay and again the basin is submerged and uh, there is a deposition of sequence of sediments E F G E F G then uh, after E F G and this fault took place that cut all the beds okay we say that H. What kind of fault it is? If you look carefully, this side is going down, this side is going up, and it is a normal fault. Okay, after that, this depletion took place due to erosion of this escarpment. Okay, P. This is the overall sequence of depletion of. the beds okay hope you learned something from this video okay because uh, i have selected only the uh, interesting one okay thank you try to share with this video with your friends okay so that they can also get the benefits